Did you know that practicing gratitude can actually rewire your brain the same way cocaine does? Scientists at UCLA made a disturbing discovery when studying long-term gratitude practitioners. People who kept daily gratitude journals for over six months showed identical brain scans to gambling addicts. Their reward centers were enlarged and impulse control was completely diminished. This explains why self-help gurus become obsessed with positivity practices. They're literally addicted to the dopamine hit from forced gratitude. These gratitude addicts develop toxic positivity, unable to process negative emotions or acknowledge real problems. They compulsively seek positive experiences to maintain their neurochemical high. Relationships crumble because they refuse to engage with others suffering or validate legitimate complaints. The brutal irony is that a practice designed to increase life satisfaction actually creates dependency and emotional numbness. Ancient Stoic philosophers warned against excessive focus on good fortune 2,000 years ago. They taught balanced reflection on both positive and negative experiences to maintain psychological equilibrium. The Stoics understood the dangers of gratitude addiction long before modern neuroscience proved them right.